how's your day going today? Good. Good. My typical day, I begin my first session with my students at 8.45, and I see 15 kids daily for 20 minutes each. When I first started Minnesota Reading Corps, I was a little nervous. I'd never taught anyone to read. I always knew how to read, but I had no idea how to teach okay. someone. And you're gonna select the two that have the same beginning sound, okay? Leg, lunch, elbow. Leg and lunch. I got to meet my internal coach, and she just eased all my fears. How are you doing? Good. Just have a few students that I kind of concerned about want to talk about okay. with you. She's the reading specialist here at Middleton, and she knows so much, and she's so helpful and willing to answer any of my questions any time of the day. She makes herself very available to me. And I have been doing the at-home reading with her. Okay. And then we'll sit down once a week to do a data meeting, talk about how every child is doing that's in the program. When I point underneath a letter, you say the letter sound, okay? It's not just coming in, sitting and doing lessons. The lessons are very structured, they're very detailed. They're really about filling those gaps where the students have, and then that ongoing progress monitoring. Callie would have a student with her in her room, and then I will sit in and watch the interaction between Callie and the students. I will look at the intervention, which might be, for example, a duet reading. Anna loved her pet. Dog. Buddy. They're going to be reading it together. It might be a repeated reading with comprehension. Annie loved her pet dog, Buddy. Where the he student will read the same passage multiple times, and after each reading, Callie will ask questions. What do you think will happen in the rest of the story? Uh, she finds Buddy. You think she's going to find Buddy? So do you think the student reads the story for one minute, and then they actually record how many words they read correct in that minute. So that gives them that sense of accomplishment and having them graph it and seeing how much they're increasing each time definitely gives them confidence. So great work. You know about that? Awesome. The student is excited because they know in that room with that Minnesota Reading Corps tutor, they're gonna be successful. And for some students, that may be the only 20 minutes of the whole day that they really feel successful. It builds their confidence, and then they can go back into the classroom, use that confidence they have. So in our building, it makes a big difference. It's great to know that I do make a difference here at the school. We have many different people that decide to become a tutor. Oh, I finished college. I'm not quite sure what I want to do next. You bundled them together to make a word. Awesome job. I did Minnesota Reading Corps because I wanted to find something to do, gain a little experience. We've also had members who are retired and now is their time to really serve. I definitely think AmeriCorps is a great way to serve and give back to the community. What you gain is just priceless. I mean, the relationships I've gained with my students, I'll never forget these students. She decided to make signs with Buddy's picture on them. Originally, after undergrad, I was thinking of pursuing something in my undergraduate degree, which was psychology. I'm going into teaching now because of Reading Corps. I think that's what I meant to do. There was a lady holding a dog. It was Buddy and her.